almost summer day because there are only four days of school left but why is it that on the weekends we're like seriously sleep in don't get up early and the kids are up at like seven in the morning today because it's a school day let's look at what time it is yes my friends it is 9 a.m and all of the children are still sleeping so let's go wake them up good morning Hi, sleepyhead girl. Good morning, Dayton. Oh, it's time to wake up, guys. Do you guys know what time it is? No. Take a guess. Like 10:30. <laughs> you wish. What do you guys think? Do you, does it look like they're ready to wake up? <laughs> okay, they are all up, and we're all at least dressed. <laughs> Even little William woke up. Hey, buddy. Hi. And we are all ready and headed to school today. And I get to go help Nikoi's class make a little craft today, which is super fun. Her teacher has like let parents sign up that want to come and do something with the class on the last week of school, which the kids love. Well, Tayden, what do you have today? You're wearing a swimming suit. Um, I have filled day. Filled day, and you're gonna get wet, from what I hear. Yep. Ooh, but this is it. This is. The last week of school is so fun. All lots of fun activities. It's kind of like, why even go to school the last week? But then the kids love it because they get to play and do fun activities with their friends. So yeah, let's go to school, peeps. Yeah. Nikoi. I had fun at your class today. Okay, okay. William, what'd you get? Oh, you broke your button spinner. Nikoi decided to invite William to recess with her today. Are you having fun? Yeah. Okay, go play. Let's show how awesome this craft is that we made today. No. Spin! William's showing his soccer skills to all the big kids at school. Ah! <laughs> Good drop kick. Oh! Now it's, you know, crazy end of school week so I have a million things to do and I have to go to Costco. I have got two little cuties in my shopping cart. Will you say hi? Rosie who is big sitting in there. <laughs> but I have the two cutest little shopping partners today. Hey William, you know what the best part about having a not very busy Costco is? Is having more samples. That means William's gonna get more samples because there won't be 150 people fighting for them. William wants to show you his rubber glove balloon. Wow. Mickey Mouse. Mickey Mouse, you're silly. Ah. It's sample time. William, what you got there? Ham. Prosciutto, say prosciutto. Prosciutto. We got some tamales. Now what do we got? Chocolate ice cream, mozzarella stick. It's a good day to have lunch at Costco. Roswell, are you having a sample too? Yeah, I didn't have an avocado, it's all over me. Blaine, what are you having now? Uh, a ranch chicken strip. Nummy. <laughs> Is this your favorite place to eat? <laughs> What's that? <laughs> Ice cream. Now what do you want, Rosie? We got hot dogs and rice. The samples are awesome today. Okay, I guess we didn't get filled up on samples. Cause William, what are you having? Giant hot dog and what's in your drink? Um, you beautiful. I don't know what And Mountain Dew, huh? And Mountain Dew. Say a little bit of everything. Yeah, a little bit of everything, but that's Mountain Dew because it's black. <laughs> and Roswell has a delicious cup. Oh, like that so yummy. That a yummy cup. Okay, when we wear these hats, that means it's game day, right, yeah. Tayden? Woo! Tayden, who we got with us? Milo. Milo's, what's up, Milo? Hey, guys. What's up? So, Tayden, what's the goal today? To, to swing at the bat, swing the bat. To swing the bat. And hit it. Okay, no, not even to hit it, just swing the bat. Yeah. We want you swinging the bat. So, what are you gonna do on your first pitch? Swing. You're gonna swing on your very first pitch. I don't even care if it's a terrible ball. 
Okay. Even in the dirt. Okay, buddy. Let's go Marlins. Let's go Marlins. Okay, Tane, here we go. <laughs> Strike five. Tane is getting warmed up. Five strikes in a row right out of the gate. Oh, a little inside. Dude, you ready? Yeah. Okay. There's Tayden. Tayden, get ready! Not a kid. Game is underway. Coach, how you feeling today? Oh, good. We gonna win? Yeah. <laughs> Hey, here we go, buddy! We had a great inning. Tied it up 3-3, and now Tayden's taking his turn on the mound. Kid, yeah! Bring it in, Marlins! Yeah, I think it's Ethan. Hey, way to pitch, kid. <gasps> Rozzy Bear, look at that fuzzy hair. So, we had to leave Tane's baseball game early. We got this guy with us. Hi, Casey. Hi. Hi, Whoa. how are you? Good, how are you? Are my teeth clean? Yeah. Christina, say hi. Hey! Don't take your eyes off the road. Oh, gosh. <laughs> so, and then, and then we got William. William, you look handsome. You're in your dolphin shirt. You look handsome, bud. <gasps> what? Did you want to say hi to these guys? Say hello. Hello. Okay, so we're headed to Nikoi's gymnastics recital. Go, Nikoi. Oh, she's already there. Yeah. That's why she's not with us. Thank heavens. Guys, find the koi. There is Coco. Okay, I'll give you a hint. She's on this side. There she is. We're sitting way over there. The koi. Good luck! Hey, you got a hole in your shoulder. I'm wearing the Kanye West line. <laughs> She's excited to see you. Did she know you were coming? I don't know if she knows coming. She saw me earlier in the house. Oh. There she is.
there's our little gymnast. High five. You did so good, beautiful. Look at her cute little hair, mom did. Mom, you did a good job. What? Sometimes she lets me do her hair. Yeah. Let's see your makeup. Did mommy do some makeup? I see some sparkly face. Do kissy lips. No, come on, go like this. Okay, smile. Smile. Okay, Nikoi say gymnastics. It's past the kids' bedtime and we decided to come to Danny's because this is where she wanted to eat. Look what she's eating though. Dinner and dessert Oh my. That just looks like dessert. Delicious. Tatum's eating chicken and macaroni and cheese. And then William's excited about his mac and cheese and bananas. <laughs> Casey's uh, pan kid pancakes are coming out soon. No, I can't <laughs> eat pancakes. <laughs> Hello, Dykes fam. Hope you guys are doing fantastic today. Um, can you guys see that? Can you see that? Does that look disgusting or what? And no, this is not Freddy Krueger makeup. This is, I got sunburned at my kid's dance festival. So let me fix that so you don't have to stare at it the whole time I'm vlogging. Is that better? <laughs> I want to show you something cool that showed up in my YouTube account. Something that we have worked very hard towards. And with your guys' help, we have achieved this. OMG! You reached 100,000 subscribers. It's time to claim your Silver Creator Award. Claim it with this code. <laughs> Honestly though, how cool is that? When we officially hit 100,000 subscribers, I checked with Social Blade to see what our subscriber rank was, and they said that we were like 40,000 something. Just barely over 40,000. That means there's over 40,000 YouTube creators who have more than 100,000 subscribers. At first that seems really high, because you're like, wow, 40,000 channels? But you gotta think about all of the celebrities, all of the musicians, all of the companies and brands that have YouTube channels with large followings. Um, it kinda narrows it down a lot more. So, But I think it's awesome, no matter what. And right now we're sitting at 124,000 subscribers, and our subscriber rank is at 35,000. So you can see here, 124,000, our subscriber rank is 35,000. So in a matter of gaining 24,000 subscribers, we've moved up 5,000 in subscriber rank, in overall rank. So that's pretty cool. I mean, I don't know if you guys care about that kind of stuff, but you know, it's, it, it's us reaching certain benchmarks and accomplishing certain goals with this whole YouTube career and this whole YouTube venture. And it's been really exciting and fun for us because, you know, I... We've been doing this for just over three years now, and it's really cool to see your success, to realize the hard work and effort that you put into something. And trust me, when we first started this, even for the first two years of it, people thought we were crazy. My Christina thought I was crazy for even trying to pursue this because we weren't growing. Things weren't coming to fruition like we would hope that it would have. But now, because of persistence and dedication, we have successfully turned this into a full-time career, a full-time job. This is what I do day in and day out. Now, I do take some consulting work on top of what I do. I am building some other projects and other ventures. Um, but this, this is my full-time focus. And so I am so happy that I didn't give up, I didn't quit. Despite all of the naysayers, despite all of the hurdles, despite even my own limitations in my mind thinking, well, we're not to this point by this time, so we should just quit, right? Well, no, there was that little that little something deep down inside me that just wouldn't quit, that wouldn't give up. And so I guess this is turning into a motivational speech <laughs> because when the odds are stacked against you and it's something that you truly desire, don't give up, don't quit because you can do it. 
Now, maybe some of you guys don't think that that's a big deal or that's a, a, a big accomplishment, but I'm telling you what, we have sacrificed and worked super hard to get to where we're at. And to us, that feels like a huge accomplishment to not only have all of your guys' love and support, but to be able to see these successes along the journey because these are benchmarks that help us to know that we're growing and we're doing the right things to be able to have something sustainable. So anyways, thank you guys for all of your support. Um, let's keep growing. Let's keep doing this. I love editing videos. I told Christina last night, holy cow, I'm rambling. I told Christina last night that after I got done editing yesterday's vlog, sometimes it's monotonous and it, um, I mean, we do it almost every single day. And so doing the same thing over and over, sometimes it gets old. But I'll tell you what, it doesn't get old. Seeing the finished video, that never gets old. Last night, I worked on a, a yesterday's vlog and it was Tayden's last soccer game and I kind of spruced it up a little bit, okay? When I say spruced up, you guys, <laughs> I'm not a professional editor, okay? I've learned how to become a, a really good amateur editor, but I am not a professional by any means. So it still takes me a, long, a lot longer than a professional editor. But here's my point. Point is, is that after I edited the video and I got it down to its final cut, it was a huge sigh of relief and I watched the video with my wife and I thought, I love this. I absolutely love this video. There's so many things about it that I love. And I am so grateful that I get to do this for my full-time job. That I get to edit these videos, these memories that we're creating and capturing. And I absolutely love it and I'm super passionate about it. And even after doing it for three years, like I, I wouldn't want to do anything else. Sometimes it's hard to get through some of the, you know, early stages of work. The hard, it's hard work, it is, it's hard work. But after you get through that and you get to the final edit and it turns out better than you imagined or hoped, it's completely worth it. And last night was just another testament to that after doing 985 videos on YouTube. Holy cow, we're almost to a thousand videos. Woo! Don't give up on your goals. Don't give up on your dreams. Be persistent and do what it takes. Do, do hard work. Hustle and do it. And you will be successful. That's it for now. I love you guys. I'm getting all sentimental and emotional. I gotta go. Bye! So we just walked in the door a few minutes ago. The kids are already up in bed and it's just past 11.30. So yeah, kind of a late night, but we had a good day today. Uh, a lot of stuff going on. That's what happens when you have lots of babies and uh, kids grow up and do things. So anyways, thanks for hanging out with us today, Dykes fam. We hope to be able to see you guys tomorrow, so be sure to check out our video tomorrow, okay? All right, we love you guys. We'll see you tomorrow. Peace out, Dykes fam. We love you.